Yo, what is up, gang? It's your guy, Jeezy, coming back with another reaction video. If you're new to the channel, like, comment, subscribe, and share the video. As always, you know what I mean? Mess with the kid, all right? I know I'm going to be able to entertain everybody. I know I ain't going to be able to please everybody, but I'm going to go ahead and try the best as I can. Video disclosure, i never seen this video. Hopefully, y'all been staying safe, staying out of the way, man, staying hydrated. I already said that. I don't know. Y'all already know, man, I'll be messing up with these intros. I'll be having to try, like, even sometimes, like, five times to get it right because I'll miss it to say something or I'll repeat myself maybe or if I can remember, you know what I mean? But, yeah, again, hopefully y'all enjoyed the video. Subscribe to the channel, bro. Stop playing. Let's go ahead. Newly released police video shows what led up to the deadly shooting of a 13-year-old boy yeah. in Texas. By the way, I knew he was 13 because I see the title. Get out! Let me see your hands! Hey, get your hands! Keep your hands up! It happened on June 3rd of last year in San Antonio. At the time, 911 calls came in for reports of gunshots and loud music at about 1 o'clock in the morning. I literally just passed by them and they were looking at me and they just shot their gun. Well, other than the 4,900 like, Just one thing I wanted to, you know, point out. Man, like, for y'all younger folks, and I'm young too, all right? I'm not 13, you know, I'm a grown man now. I mean, an adult and an adult, you know. How, whatever age you think an adult is, you know, that's totally up to you, though. But in the state that I reside in or that I live in, an adult is 18 years old. You're a responsible adult at that time. Like, you have entered your adulthood and you are responsible as a pawn for your actions and everything you do okay but besides that you know what i mean for y'all younger folks man are below 18 years old 17 16 15 14 all the way down to you like five years old all right if you got the resources you got an education all right you got family brothers and sisters that are moving up their way to try to achieve greatness you know following their footsteps you know especially if it's your mom and your dad too all right Following them for steps because if you have that education, you got all those resources. I suggest, bro, you leave the streets alone, all right? If you ain't really from there or if you're not really about it, bro, stay out of the streets, bro, for real, because it's better off, bro. You don't have anything here and have freedom at the same time rather than going and trying to eat and get caught and then get locked up for it. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say, you feel me? So let's go ahead. And somebody's shooting me. Like AR or something out here. Okay. How many minutes ago did you hear the gunshot, sir? Well, literally like two, three seconds ago. And how many gunshots have you heard? Over 20. Dash and body 20. camera video show three San Antonio Police Department officers respond to the calls, eventually zeroing in on a stolen red Toyota Corolla. The driver was 13-year-old Andre Hernandez. All right. Hey! As officers approach, damn the vehicle, man, police officer was so in panic mode he couldn't even open the door. Ramming into a squad car. Bro, it better be a dang on good reason for the 13 year old to do this. The video then shows Officer Stephen mm. Ramos get out of his vehicle. He opens fire, hitting 13 year old Hernandez. Separate dash cam video shows Hernandez stumble out of the driver's seat. The officer then works to detain him. At the same time, the officer whose squad car was hit climbs through the window. Get out! Let me see your hands! Hey, get out! Keep your hands up! Keep your hands where I can see them! Get out! Yeah, Body Pistol camera drawing video and shows a person in the back seat of the stolen car with their hands up. The video is later blurred as the person is under 18. I want him out of it. Keep your hands up! Keep your hands up! Right. Where's your hands? Keep y'all's hands up! Mm. After this, he can be heard yelling to officers, asking to contact Hernandez's family. Hey, he threw that bag over there! That... Can you call his sister, please? Hey, don't move! Come here, sit down right here! Sit down right there, we're gonna try to help him out! Sit down right there! call his family! Hernandez was mm. taken to the hospital, but man, he died. And I want all the same, man, for y'all younger folks, and really towards everybody, bro. All of our consequences are free, man. I can't even talk right, man. It's, it's early in the morning, all right? But anyways, you know, I haven't done these videos in a while, so I thought maybe I had time, I'll upload one. But anyways, back to what I was saying, all right? Listen, listen real quick and look, listen closely. Look at me, all right? All right. All of our actions have consequences versus good and bad. But of course, if you want to have the good consequences, step correctly because 
for whatever i don't know yet what was the motive behind stealing the vehicle and running off i don't really know bro but from the get-go when they said stealing the vehicle bro what do you really need to steal a vehicle if it's not other than bro your mom or your girl giving birth bro to your brother or your baby bro what the hell is the point man stealing the car man for what for what and then you picked up your bros or whatever, man. They in the backseat and everybody, they could have got shot, you know, along with you. Like, everybody could have got shot, bro. Like, they didn't really have to go this route. But that's all pretty much just all I have to say, man. Like, everything we do In a report outcome. released by the Bexar County Criminal District Attorney's Office, officials say Officer Ramos was within his rights to use deadly force against Hernandez because of this key moment. Hey! Let me see your hands! Body camera video I mean, shows that officer identified only as Kid's 13, so he probably ain't got no driver's license or even a permit because now even where I live, you got to be like 14 and a half or almost 15 years old to get a permit, a learner's permit, which you got to have somebody who's 21 and that had a driver's license for at least four years. That's the only time you can drive is if they're in the car with you. So we could pretty much safely say like the, the kid didn't know how to drive. And at this position, at this particular moment, he could have been in like panic mode and he just hit the car. You know what I mean? He probably didn't mean to. He was just wanting to get away. He probably didn't mean to hurt anybody or do any harm towards anybody. He's just ramming it. You know what I mean? And now he shot him. I, I don't know. Sir I feel like that was kind of unnecessary to use deadly force. Back That's all I'm pretty much car I'm trying to say. Hernandez crashes into it with the Toyota. Law enforcement argue Officer Ramos's use of deadly force was justified because he believed the other officer was in danger. Last week, the district Man, attorney's office presented the case to a grand jury. They declined to indict Officer Ramos and later released the body and squad camera footage. Reporting mm. for Long Crime Network, I'm Sierra Gillespie. I mean, I can understand, bro. Police officer could have been scared. But at the same time, bro, it, it, it's a it's a boy that just went into middle school, you know. But I mean, hey, they they call in or whoever that guy was that was talking to the dispatcher. They just, they they say that they heard gunshots, so he might have maybe thought that they had a, they had a gun on the car, or whatever, or on the person. But anyways, man, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Alright, I know it might it probably too much. Um, I am not feeling very well, so that's why you know you might be able to hear my my cracks and muffle you know in my voice but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video again hopefully you guys are enjoying your weekend staying safe staying out the way you're new to the channel like comment subscribe and if you made it to this point in the video man i appreciate you hopefully safety and prosperity to all of you hopefully y'all been uh y'all been chilling man y'all been chilling time be flying man you really think about it, everything that you have gone through and myself as well and to this point on at this second you're watching my video man it's been a lot a lot bro that we have gone through and Pretty much all I wanted to cover, you know what I mean? Yeah, can't really think of anything else, man. Peace out.